There we go. I'm getting the hang of the rhythm. Though, um, as soon as I get the... Um, they have a katana blade. As I said, everything, everything's everything been changed. Uh, the weapons have been changed a little bit differently. So we have water here. And let's drain the aqueduct. Bam. <laughs> and this guy... Ow. So we're right, we're actually right underneath where um, Julius, where he did his cool sick jump over here like a jerk. So we have to take the, uh, take the low ground, take the low. He's got the high ground, we got the low ground. Ah, actually second favorite song. Oh gosh, <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> ah, yes. Uh, I think there's a save point. Yes. Yeah, they did actually did a really good job on this game. I think, well, I said, I, I know I'd probably be crazy person talking about the art style all the time, but the art style really does make a big difference. Take that, slime. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, these guys are always trouble. Uh. Oh, cool. Oh. Well, I just wasted that. Oh, well. Oh, well. That's said, I'll get it back. But now this... Yeah, actually, I I do think this game is better, but I think... Oh, perfect. So, I personally like katana weapons, because, as I said, this does about 11 damage, which is not bad. But the cool thing about katanas is they're actually um, sword drawing techniques. So you can... So you can... One, two, three. Because these, these are my favorites, because I don't have to... Like, the... The timing is pretty loose on doing, like, uh, double attack, double attacks anyways. And then you add a dash cancel into that. Oh. Let's see if we can hit that. Aha! Actually, that doesn't do much. Ugh. Unfortunately, it's a little bit it's a little bit weaker than the claymore, but I feel like the mobility is better. And I I don't know I prefer mobility. I, I would rather be able to like I said I can attack three times pretty consistent with this as opposed to uh, as opposed to the claymore, which is like just me jumping. See? Perfect. Eh, get the heart. <laughs> See? I feel like I can take I feel like I can take people down faster. Ow. Oh man. Okay. You're being a jerk. See? Much easier. My inputs are... My inputs are much cleaner. I prefer... I prefer fast, clean inputs. Oh. I like how a bone can block fire. And... Ah, yes. Unfortunately... Oh. Chill out, bro. So, I need a... I need an actual... I need an actual uh, ability here. 
Ow. Oh man. Oh man. Ah, I thought I was out of his range. Oh well. I think there's a save point around here anyway. Or it looks like it. Cause I I might be like telepathic. So so as you can see how it says says level one out of three. So the more so if I get another one, I get level two. Which is like the fastest levels I've gotten. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this one's actually really cool. So the warp rooms so I can actually go back to the I'm gonna do that real fast so I can unlock that but you can actually go back to um, so I can I can go I can go back to the shop and Yoko at any time anywhere I find one of these um, warp rooms and it's really cool uh, I, I really like it a lot oh so <clears throat> Let's check this out. So now... Huh. I guess it's like six. Huh. I thought it... I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. Actually, let's go left. Hmm. Do, 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 do. Dang it. Okay, good. <laughs> the cool thing is they will get stronger. But I think maybe it's six. I don't know. I don't entirely know for sure. Because having leveled up souls, or leveled up souls are like the best. Because they get stronger, like the projectile gets bigger. Oh, okay. Oh, we were actually already here. Huh. That's interesting. Ooh, got a scarf. Let's see. Scarf. Gives me a little more constitution or whatever. I think the con, the con, con is usually your your defense. Let's see. Okay, not too bad. Oh, rock monster. Oh, cool. Sweet. Get Rex, sir. Personally, I like the bomber soul. Because when you, when you max it out, it has like a really cool effect. Like, um, because the original ones look like those bombs. Actually, no, we'll do this, because we're getting close. Oh, someone's here. You! Ah, you've come just as I predicted. Celia Fortner. You're kidding, right? You're telling me this punk's the Lord of Darkness. Ha! Judging matters. Merely on appearance. Tsk, tsk, simpletons are so vexing. What'd you call me, Dmitri? <laughs> I merely stated a fact. Dario, Dimitri, both of you. Enough. I don't know how to read that. Hmm. Excuse their behavior. Welcome to our house. Home to our church. You talk as if you were expecting me. You fear that you... You fear that you will imper you will imperil innocence for who, uh, who, who you are and, and can become. Am I not correct? Yes. I fell for your ruse. Why would you want to resurrect the Dark Lord? 
We do not desire to... We do, uh, we do not desire the Dark Lord, per se. For God to be perfectly good, there must be a being of perfect darkness. That has nothing to do with me. If this world does need a perfect dark being, one should emerge. Isn't that how it works? Perhaps that is so, and perhaps it is not. What is true, however, is that the power of the darkness steadily grows faint. The Lord of Darkness must be enthroned without fail, and without a moment, and not a moment too soon. But that doesn't mean I heard enough already. Let's rip this punk <laughs> apart right here, right now. Have patience. He will try and stop me using whatever means. There's no need for haste. Huh? What are you saying? How the heck, hun? <laughs> okay, this is a little weird. He is in our hands now. We can destroy him whenever, whenever, however we wish. Correct. This will also serve as a test for both of you. I see. Wait a second. Test? What test? Gosh, I didn't hear anything about... I didn't hear about that. Are you incapable of thinking even a little? There's one, but one Dark Lord, and yet two candidates, you and I. Duh, I know that and get this through your hollow skull. Whoever defeats this boy becomes chosen as the Lord of Darkness. Oh, I get it now. Yeah, okay. This'll make it fun. Next time I see you, punk, I'll burn you to ashes. I shall depart also. I see no significance in my presence here at this time. Uh-oh. Okay, good. So, those two are the Dark Lord candidates. Correct. They were born at the same time as Dracula's demise. They are inheritors of Dracula's dark powers. But that's no guarantee that they become the Dark Lord. They can, by shattering Dracula's soul. If you wish to stop me, I'll be waiting for you at the top, like everyone usually is. I may even change my mind if you survive my traps. So yeah, she's annoying. Huh, see? We got our boss. So, I'm gonna check on something. I just wanna see how long we've recorded. So, it's gonna be like, pause. So, do forgive me for a moment. Oh, okay. That's not too bad. Well, this is always tough. See, let's do it like that. Okay, better. Okay, we are back. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. No. Okay, let us uh, fight this next boss. He's a little bit more difficult, but we saved and all is well. Actually, no. Always paranoid. Make a double save. Cause that's always been like my big paranoia. That, that's it. That's what I do with Pokemon. I save like three times. So that's the seal that you're using. And this will be interesting. So, oh no. Mekawashu Beam. So, essentially, that's the power we're going to get. Power to break blocks. So this big bastard. Always watch his fists. Oh, I went the wrong way. Wow, I'm getting wrecked. This is actually a much harder time. Oh, actually hits twice. Ugh. Uh, 
that was so close. Because I was like, where's my, where's my cursor? <laughs> So, now you touch the screen to shatter certain blocks. Ability type tactical soul. Um, does not require equipping. So, oh, never mind, you can't go. It looks like there's a doorway over there, but there's not. So, basically, what we do is you click on these. We break the blocks. So, it's essentially, I don't know, it kind of reminds me of, uh... <laughs> How many potions did I use there? Oh gosh. Actually, I used three. Like I said, I'll get a little bit better at this. This one's I'm a, this one is actually this one is actually more difficult. It is far far more far more difficult than actual uh, the original area of sorrow. Because yeah, you'll see me actually getting more and more uh you'll probably you'll see me probably stock up on potions a lot more this time which is good like i said i like my games with a little bit of difficulty let's see yeah we'll go this way ah yeah frankenstein and yeah He's also, that guy's also a little bit more difficult because you actually have to jump and hit him in the face versus other. Versus like other enemies like these in which I can three shot him. Whoa. Oh. Get hit with the bones. And the cool thing, I think the cool thing too is I think it like, ah, well, we'll fight him anyways. Jump over him. So yeah, unfortunately we can't get over here just yet. We have little switches on the other side. So yeah, we don't need to go the, just go the other way. Huh. Come on. Yeah, see, level two now. So watch. The bone is a little bit bigger. And it does much more damage. Oh, wow. This is the fastest I've ever gotten. So I have six. And the max you can get is actually nine. Actually, hold on. Eh, yeah, screw it. We'll, we'll go back a little bit later. Oh, actually, we're much stronger now. Cool. Just three shot everyone now. Ugh. Cool, can just punch people. So now, the bone is stronger. Oh, yes, she, you jerk. Ow. Okay, is that everybody? That looks to be it. So, the fun, well, I actually like these because like, I don't know, to me it reminds me of like, the packing bubbles. Like it sometimes it's just fun to just pop everything. Do 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 pop 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 pop. So we need to do that to get to the next area. So, don't pop those, or don't uh, break those ones. Cause yeah. Do 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 do. Tea bag for good measure. Always tea bag. Just kidding. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> don't forget. Don't always always remember to duck. So 
So this is our next area. Yeah. Cool. Then we have a boomerang. Hmm. Actually, I think this is. Yep. They usually, usually at the beginning of an area, there always is a save point. So let's see what we got here. Yeah. Hey, tree guy. Oh, shoot. Oh, cool. So this is our next oh, magic seal. And they get harder. Oh. Okay, that's really cool. Actually, I'm gonna do one thing, girl. Actually, actually, never mind, because I, I forget that the, um, the little uh, grade off area to the to the left. Um, we don't really need that at the moment, so I was going to. I was like, eh, fill up the map. Why not? But in all honesty, we don't really need to. Oh, another breastplate. Cool. Oh, yeah. Oh. Because there's those little screamy guys. The good thing is they don't... It's not a full screen hit. Oh. Actually, let's go this way. Let's unlock um, the door. Ow. Oh, cool. So we need a double jump now. Probably get the double jump over there, but... Whoa! Oh, cool. Oh, that's nice. See, the bone is much stronger. It is... It is a much more usable weapon. Ow. Good trade, dude. So, now we can unlock the other side. Oh, I thought it was... I thought it was two hits. Yeah, so, let's continue... from the demon house. Slap. Okay. Okay, just wanted to make sure. Cool. Oh, that's what that noise was. Ow! <laughs> Stupid jerk. Hit me like I was Donkey Kong. Yeah, these. Okay. Uh... Okay. Oh, you know what? Maybe I should not have done that. Oh no! Let's see, can I... Ah, I cannot. No, get away from me. Oh, what's this ability, Soul? Oh yeah, this one's actually really cool. 
So what the doppelganger actually does is that, um, so I can actually have two, two class sets. I can always have, I can have, I don't know, let's, let's add claymore, breastplate, scarf, and then we'll add, well, unfortunately, all we have really good is just those. So now I can go from this to sword, to um, katana, which is really cool, actually. Like I, I, I really like these. Like that, that was. I mean, it's it's a it's all of these are uh, very good uh, upgrades, to be perfectly honest. Ow. Oh yeah, that one's kind of fun. But yeah, now we have the ability... Ah, oh, birds. What's up, bird? What's over here? Let's check. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, little tiny devils. We used to use them at the beginning of the Area of Sorrow game. Oh, perfect. I... Oh. I need a hell. I need a save point. So yeah, let's... Bring it on. Haha. -ha. If I if I get theirs, I'll probably use theirs for a while. <sighs> Dang it. I do not have a Okay. Hey girl. I do not have a double jump. Actually, you know, let's let's get a little focused here. Yeah, let's stay focused in here. So annoyed. Oh yeah, I think. Oh yeah, you just play the lotto here. So basically, it goes by your um, it goes by your uh, gold count. So I have to have seven, seven hundred and seventy-seven gold. So we're back, and we finally have 777 gold. And then we hit this. And then again, teabag for good measure. Haha! -ha. Puzzle solved. So we get a little bit of extra. Oh, three sevens. What does three sevens do? Oh, wow. That substantially <laughs> increases our luck. Like, wow. So, it's pretty cool. Say, so let's go and find a save point. Try and avoid fighting just a little bit. Oh, there's a gun up there. Cool. Yeah, there, there actually was a there actually was a gun in um uh, area of sorrow. Okay. 
we're gonna fight the boss. And, um, probably gonna call it quits after that. Because I just wanted to see if it was a proof of concept. Take that, you jerk. Oh, F this stupid monster. What? I don't have it, I guess. Yes, let's practice. Or no, it's this way, huh? Uh-oh. Okay, never mind. The good thing is the poison does not uh, take away from your overall... Is it like, uh, it's not like normal poison. So let's go this way. So yeah, I'm just gonna save, and then I'm gonna check the footage and see if it works. Do 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 do. Check the footage. Yeah, we're just gonna save for right now. So this is just kind of proof of concept. If it works, I don't know. I'll continue a little bit later. But I hope you guys enjoyed so far. We're gonna keep exploring and find out the rest of the. Um, Find out where the rest, where that magic seal I need. Maybe it's probably in here. If it's not in there, it's probably in there or any other place. I don't know. This game is a lot of fun. As I said, if you do have the means to, I would recommend trying to play it. But until then, um, just thumbs up and subscribe for more Castlevania. And I will see you guys in the, ne in the next video. And uh, this is Justin from KQS. And until we meet again, comrades.